Peace and prosperity beyond to all who and watching. It's your girl Shay Miller Wright, and I'm back with another video. And today, guys, the wait is over. Everything from your harvest, the fruit of your labor, from the finances, from the abundance, for the opportunities, the doors. He says, "Seek and you shall have. Seek, seek and you shall find. Ask and you shall receive." knock and it shall be open unto you now you have been consistent seeking god consistently asking god consistently um praying to god and talking to god about the things that he said about your life and the things that he said that you shall do if you have been consistent in doing these things you shall see change you shall see change in your life from this day forward you shall see the things that god is doing I know it's not always easy because life is not easy, right? But if you do what's easy, life will always be hard. But if you do what's hard, life becomes easier. And the thing about life is you want to always be able to face challenges. You want to always be that person who can overcome uh, what you're facing. You want to always be somebody who can solve problems. Problems are bigger than you, right? Problems bigger than you, but your mind is capable of understanding and explaining and breaking things down, right? You want to get to a place in your life where your problem solving is greater than your, your troubles. It's greater than your storms in life because when you have storms, you're able to solve the problem. You look at the storm as something that is easy to face. All things in life require solutions, require answers, require results, require growth or change, require shifting. If it's not working, why isn't it working? How can I improve it? So going forward, if you're facing something, a storm, a problem, issues with yourself, issues with your mind, issues with your mental health, you want to make sure that you're able to overcome those challenges. You want to be able so great and overcoming things to the point where your problem solving is unmatchable. That your ability to help people solve their problems, your ability to help yourself solve problems is greater than those around you. Not that you need to have all the answers for everything, but you need to be able to be quick and swift with solving problems you need to have answers you need to know that you know that you know that this works and you need to be able to help other people who are experiencing the same or people who've never experienced it and they're just starting to experience it or people who want to know so they never have to experience it you want to be so equipped for your calling, so quit for the things that you've called to do in life, so quit for your purpose, so quit for what God has said about you, that when it comes to the problems that you'll face and the storms that may come to you and the trials that you have to go through, that no storm is of no match for your ability to overcome, your ability to be victorious and your ability to soar beyond this, right? Like an ego. Because the ego always stay at high grounds. It's always flying above, never below. As above, so below. You have to rise. Rise like a phoenix. You have to soar like an ego. And you have to jump and fly and go to the places God has called you to. You have to be courageous and bold in your decision making. And you have to be wise going forward. Peace and love be unto all who's watching. And I pray your day is blessed.